Greetings everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you can see, enjoyable day here in Abu Dhabi. The reason I'm making this video is for you people that want to improve your English language because I have many messages on my Instagram and on my YouTube platform about how to improve English, how to better speak, how to develop yourself better for a job like a cabin crew job, right? So there are three tips I want to talk about in this video, uh, ladies and gents. Number one is read books in English. Now, I want you to pick a book that you are interested in, a topic, a topic that you're interested in, something that you're passionate about. Take a book on that idea, on that passion and just read it. Read it, try to read it in one week, right? If it doesn't work, give it two weeks. If after that it doesn't work, pick up one more book and read one more book. I'm sure that will actually help a lot ladies and gents. When you read books also you can use a dictionary. You have your phone, right? We have Google nowadays so it's actually easy. You just type the word on Google and you will find the definition. You don't even have to search in a physical dictionary anymore. You can you can read any books. You can read ebooks, you can read the physical paper book, right? Some people read on their iPads, like whatever floats your boat. Just uh, read it helps so much. Now, why am I saying that you should pick up a subject that you actually are interested in? Well, because then it's gonna be easier for you to read, right? If you just pick a romance book, but you are into uh, novels or horror or uh, uh, poetry, then the romance book will not have any meaning, right? Like you will not enjoy reading it. So if you are into, let's say tech, pick up a book about technology. Whatever you into, just uh, try to stick to that and it's gonna be, it's gonna make the process easier. Now, number two tip, ladies and gents, number two is <laughs> watching Netflix and everybody nowadays enjoys streaming movies. It's a big part of our culture. And when I say watch Netflix, I don't mean watch Netflix and chill, if you know what I mean, right? I'm talking about watching uh, TV series and watching movies properly with your whole attention focused there. Now, my advice for you is watch the movies in English with English subtitles. Why? Because you will correlate the written with the spoken English and that will make the learning process easier. And it definitely worked for me. I've been watching movies since I was a kid. I was really passionate about movies. Indeed, nowadays movies are not so good as, as they used to be, at least in my opinion. But still, there's plenty of good ones. They're good TV series. Watch them and learn. A bonus here would be if you try to imitate your favorite actresses and actors. That's what I used to actually do. Like, let's say there's a movie with Brad Pitt and we'll just take the Brad Pitt persona, I will, not try, I will try to imitate what he's saying in the movie and it actually worked and it, it works really well, you know, to be honest. I recommend that to everybody. Uh, go to the mirror, look in the mirror, look at yourself and imitate your favorite actors and actresses. So ladies and gents, what can I say? Enjoy your Netflix. If you don't have Netflix, there's plenty of other options, you know, Amazon Prime, uh, you can go to the cinema, you can stream movies from your laptop, you know. You can be a pirate if you if you choose to. I'm not encouraging that, but whatever floats your boat. <laughs> you got it, floats your boat. Anyway, watch movies, ladies and gents. That's one of the secrets. Third tip that I have for you, the third tip. We live within technology. We have technology at our fingertips the whole time. Now, a phone is part of your daily life. You have it, you carry it in your pocket or purse. I would suggest you use it for a greater purpose. Learn English from it. There's so many language learning apps available on uh, Play Store and iOS Store. So many of them. And one that I recommend is actually Duolingo, if you know the app. So yeah, that's number three tip, ladies and gents. Use your resources, use the apps use them you might actually uh, get somewhere with them you know you'll, you'll get a step ahead uh, definitely all right a bonus tip for you ladies and gents a bonus tip if you can if you can you should consider traveling and meeting other people communication is so important nowadays and i believe you have to be a good communicator in order to learn a language so if you have the possibility to go traveling by all means do it 
if you can be in circles with other people that know English and they can talk with you in English apart from your own nationality, you should definitely consider that as well. Ladies and gents, this has been it for today. I will keep enjoying my day off here in Abu Dhabi. Very sunny, very pleasant. Um, until next time, please like, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not subscribed yet. Until next time, my name is Alex. See you on the next one, ladies and gents.